Welcome to part number two of Gran Turismo PSP. This is the Moving Chicane, and today we're doing Driving Challenge B, Types of Corners. And let's see what types of corners we're gonna corner. B1, driving through gradual curves at beginner course. Okay, this should be really easy. Yeah, oh yeah, this is, oh jeez. <laughs> Okay, yeah, this is gonna be easy. It's like that one um, B2 test in Gran Turismo 5, the one that's just called Steering. Hey, CK, what's up, man? Am I using proper FOV? Uh, no, never. Driving Bark Miyabi, pretty much. That's pretty much what Beginner Course became, I guess. Shame is not a pink bit. <laughs> B2, driving through gradual S-curves. And which S-curve are we running through? Oh, midfield. Ready? Okay, I'm so bad at this that I got a bronze. But I think I turned in too early. I probably shifted too early as well. There we go. There's the goal that we should have gotten on the first attempt. Hey, welcome back, Noodles. You really haven't missed much. <laughs> it's just been really easy exams. So, driving through hairpins. The first turn at Autumn Ring. High speed ring is a close second. Midfield was the best track not in GT Sport. Oh, yeah, I agree, dude. We just need the original tracks back. You're making food? Oh, what are you making? Yeah, the, the Gran Turismo 3 version is good, but the GT6 version is pretty badass still man like I love how in the tunnel there's like that whole little restaurant or whatever inside the tunnel there's like a whole like it's either like a restaurant or a shopping plaza I can't remember but it's a really nice thing that polyphony added to the tunnel it gave it a lot of life you know which is cool mastery in the high speed corner that's a uh, turn two at Fuji yep Fuji mission chips that's cool. Yeah, that one really didn't take too much effort. <laughs> Alright, what's next? The best version of Fuji. Swiss Alps, driving on dirt. Ready? Well, I suck at dirt track racing, as you guys know. And uh, I hit the wall into turn number three. So I have to hit the brakes a little bit earlier. Probably use the chase cam, too, so that way I can see where I'm going. That should be about a silver run, maybe. Oh no, a gold run. Okay, cool. Cool, we'll take it. Why didn't they use Switch Self for Grand Canyon as dirt tracks? El Capitan dirt track on GT4 is pretty fun. Yep. The cathedral tracks were really good. There's actually a cathed cathedral rocks number three in here, which is like a little oval. It's really cool. Ready? Okay, third attempt at this challenge. I. I gotta be a little bit faster. Am I steering with the analog stick? Uh, yes I am. <laughs> You've been playing too much GTA with Marvin? Nice. There we go. You're excited for the new GT Sport update? I am too, even though I'm giving the game a good amount of time away. I, I need to give the game a serious break. The PSP analog stick isn't good for steering, so you gotta use the D-pad you install GTA. Uh, okay. Well, it's emulated, so... Congratulations, you have completed Challenge Group B. You can now move on to Challenge Group D. But we have to go to C first. Um, yeah, that's probably why, too. Like, Xbox One controller is just better than the freaking PSP. I knew if they would be good. More bugs and glitches. 
Yeah, and better, and better supposedly safety rating. You are now in Challenge Group D, and the user's soundtrack has been unlocked. You can now listen to your favorite MP3 when you're behind the wheel. Awesome, and that's what we're going to be doing next time. We're going to be doing Challenge Group C, mastering difficult situations, and finally using our MP3s.